Okay, mommies and daddies. This is a review of the Summer Bassinet. My wife had ordered this online um, a couple months ago. Well, probably not a couple months ago. Probably just before our second daughter was born. And she was born in March. She's seven weeks old now. So, regardless, uh, this is something that she bought online that, uh, that we really enjoy. We never really used a bassinet at all. In fact, we, we actually never did. And uh, she's seen this on Amazon, kind of liked it, so she went ahead and bought it. I'm going to do a quick review on it, and I'm going to review it in five different areas, meaning cost, design, durability, assembly, and how well Emily likes it, because this is the one that Emily uses. So, <clears throat> first off, the brand is Summer, like I said. It comes with, real quick, let me just show you this. It comes with this uh, little box here that just mounts right on the side of the bassinet. It's got different vibration settings on it. It'll play different sounds, music, nature sounds, or a heartbeat sound, volume control, and different songs. Um, it actually is pretty nice. The music's kind of cheap sounding, but what do you expect? It's just something that comes with it. As far as cost goes, first, um, it was fairly cheap. I, I don't know the exact price right now, so I couldn't tell you. But I would rate that 9 out of 10, 10 being most affordable. I would say 9 out of 10. It was uh, you know, relatively cheap, and uh, it worked out good. Uh, design, I would give it an 8 out of 10, because I think there's a few design flaws. But, um, for instance, the two rear wheels have locks on them, so you can lock the two rear wheels, but the front wheels don't have that. It's just the, the back ones, and that's to me a little a little iffy it's got this bottom compartment down here that you can put stuff in um, we put some diaper bags down there with the spare diapers and wipes and uh, basically anything that we would need for changing a diaper is down there the the uh, desitin cream and stuff like that we usually don't use um, powder that's Tarzan over there say hi Tarzan no okay um, we don't usually don't use powder, but that's beside the point. Um, but I think there's a few design flaws, so I give that an 8 out of 10. Durability, I would say 9 out of 10, because you'll see it has, it's a little, I mean it's very sturdy, it's not going anywhere. But if you rock it like this, it's got a little bit of a mo little movement to it. Uh, I kind of use that to rock Emily sometimes, by just that gentle pushing so I would the durability I would say 9 out of 10 uh, I think it was rated up to 30 pounds I think so I believe 30 pounds so 9 out of 10 on durability the assembly I'm gonna give it a 6 out of 10 because it was actually difficult to assemble uh, certain parts come already put together and certain parts don't you need an allen key to put it together and they did not provide an allen key with it Thankfully, I had one, so I was able to put it together. Also, you're going to see this metal, I'm sorry, this plastic cap right here. There's one of those up here as well, but I couldn't get it put on there because the way it's designed, you just can't get that to fit. It just doesn't do it. So the metal cap, it, the, I'm sorry, the plastic cap is not up here, but the screws are still in it, so it is secure. It's not going anywhere. It just doesn't have that cap, but it's blocked by this uh, sunshade anyways which does have velcro right here on both sides so you can get it to stay up if you wanted it to so six out of ten on assembly because uh, it kinda was difficult with a few of the uh, the allen screws <coughs> and different things so six out of ten as far as baby liking Emily loves it uh, I would say a solid ten out of ten because she absolutely loves loves this thing now I'm gonna give you a brief overview of it like I showed you, uh, it has that bottom compartment down there that has some diaper bags down here. Um, the two rear wheels are locking. The front wheels don't. Other than that, that's it for the bottom. It does have this sunshade right here that has the Velcro on either side. So you can Velcro that up to block the sun, block the light whatever you need to do comes with this like I said 
comes with a little mattress pad and uh, this is actually a mattress cover that's on it that can come off for easy washing the pad itself is about that thick it uh, is very soft very soft almost like memory foam it kind of waits a second before it fills back up with air uh, it's very soft very comfortable a little crinkly but that's okay but it's got little animal designs on it right here different designs it's got the little vanity that hangs down I'm trying to think what else on this thing um, the two ends look like that but I'm assuming it's very comfortable because Emily sleeps in it all the time uh, she can be out here with us um, when we're out here as a family uh, she's not sitting in her swing <clears throat> she's not in her crib in her room she's not on the floor obviously we have two dogs and uh, a 14 month old almost 15 month old running around so sometimes it's kind of hard just to have her out here but if she sits in that it's nice we can set her up by the window she can get some solid pure vitamin D and uh, gives her something comfortable she can be in where she's out here part of the family it does not take up much room at all I'm trying to see if I have something that I can kind of give you an idea of how big it actually is um, well with just me standing by it oops, you can kind of see roughly how big it would be uh, it's actually not too bad it's got all the warning labels on the inside for you that you can read those it's got warning labels all over it uh, so it's very easy to see so you can read up on all of those if you need to but um, <clears throat> it's good size it's, it's you know it's durable very cheap um, I usually don't care for the summer brand and that's strictly because we had a baby monitor by summer there you can see summer I uh, had a baby monitor by summer and it was awful so I usually don't care for summer equipment but I gotta say this is one of their better ones and I'm very pleased with it overall but the few design flaws like I said but other than that it's a very good um, product I really like it Emily likes it uh, actually Abby climbs up onto the bottom rail there and puts her hands up top and she looks down at her sister and says hello so it's cute that she gets to see her as well and she's up off the ground you know this is almost waist high you know almost waist high so she's up off the ground um, <clears throat> she's not too low doesn't hurt your back too much to bend over change a diaper pick her up whatever you gotta do so that's the summer bassinet review any other questions about it, please inbox us, let us know. Like, subscribe, comment below, whatever you need to do, we're here to support you on all of your parenting needs. Any questions, we don't judge, we are here to assist you. So go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, do whatever you got to do, and always be safe.